a lovely subscriber of mine has asked me to do a video about my kind of beauty routine and how I manage to find time to do all my kind of beauty treatments and little tips and tricks on to kind of fitting it all into a busy life. So I thought that was a great, great idea and not something I've ever really talked about before and I couldn't wait to do it. So the first things first is I think the difference um, with me is that because I love beauty so much, it's never a chore, so I'm never like, oh, I have to paint my nails and I can't be bothered. I like doing it, so it's never a chore for me, so it's something that I always look forward to doing, so I don't have to necessarily make time for it. But um, I have kind of got everything down to the minimum time, unless I'm kind of doing it leisurely because I want to, if that makes sense. So the first um, thing that I kind of really have to spend time on is hair removal because my brows can get out of control if I don't pluck them for a few days so what I tend to do is in the morning before I get ready I'll just kind of give them a quick touch up every few days and then I don't have to kind of do a big sit down that'll take ages to do so I'll do that every couple of days and that's something that really helps me to kind of keep a neat face if that makes sense and the same goes for other methods of hair removal I'll give myself a bikini wax um, every two and a half to three weeks that doesn't take me a very long time I have mentioned how I do it before I'll try and link the videos um, down below but that doesn't take me a very long time at all which is great so I will do that a couple of times a week a uh, couple of times a week once every two and a half to three weeks um, and that's really quick then in terms of like underarms and that kind of thing I'll kind of shave them once every other day so if I do it every day which is what I'd like to do because it gives it the smoothest finish I'd be really sore it kind of gets really aggravated so I do it kind of one day yes one day no and I have been shaving my legs again lately which I shouldn't do but it's just because Epilating is quite time consuming and I've been really busy so I've kind of gone back to shaving them which is not something that I really like doing but I do that every day which is kind of um, a bit odd I know but I just like having really smooth legs so I'll do that every day when I'm in the shower or having a bath because that's kind of the quickest option for me. Then in terms of kind of manicure pedicure I like to always have really nice nails and I always paint my nails at night so when you're sitting down at night and maybe you're reading or you're um, watching TV do your nails then it takes like five minutes and it's done so I always do it at night and I always feel like my nail polish lasts better if I do it at night as well it's kind of starting to chip a little bit now I'm wearing Revlon cherries in the snow but I'll do my nails at night my ne my um, pedicure I'll kind of give myself a kind of proper pedicure maybe once every two weeks so kind of exfoliate I use foot cream every night so my feet always kind of feel okay and then I do a gel um, polish on my toes so I'll use the um, sensation nail gel kit I'll use that on my toes and just do that every night uh, not every night do that sorry once every kind of two weeks um or once every three weeks depending on how well it's lasting but i don't have to worry about that once that's done because they last so well on toes and as i said my hands i change the color probably once once or twice a week definitely once um but i will usually do it kind of a couple of times because i like to change the color so that's um that then in terms of tanning that's somewhere that I kind of struggle with and I'd love to know what your tanning routine is because I don't feel like tanning once a week is enough I don't feel like the the color lasts long enough and like now this is probably day um I did this on I did this on Thursday and it's Wednesday today so kind of like day six and the colour is not really strong enough for me, I like a kind of nice proper tan, so I don't really know how I feel about tanning. I'd like to do it more than once a week, but I feel like you have to let the tan kind of fade properly before you slap on some more, so I'm not sure how I feel about that. But I also make sure that I have a kind of pamper night twice a week, so I do it on a Wednesday and on a Saturday, and I'll kind of fill myself a bath, take in YouTube, um, take in my kind of tablet and watch YouTube videos while I'm in there and um, kind of put on a face mask, exfoliate, exfoliate my body, get out, put body butter on and just really treat myself to a nice relaxing time and this doesn't take a long time, we're talking like pff, an hour tops but in I'm only actually sat in the bath for like 15-20 minutes, I can't sit in the bath for a really long time, I get bored 
so um, I'll kind of do that a couple of times a week and that's a really nice way to kind of keep yourself always looking in tip top condition because you're really pampering yourself and you're really making yourself look and feel kind of energised and relaxed at the same time so really try and make sure you give yourself time to do those things because they are important and I, like I said I'll apply a face mask get out give myself a bit of a facial massage a hair mask that type of thing and it just really helps to kind of make you feel and look your best so that is my kind of head to toe beauty routine I hope you found this helpful it's something a little bit different and you asked me to talk about it so I did I'd love 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 to know what your beauty routine is I found this absolutely fascinating so write me in the comments below what your kind of weekly or I don't know beauty routine is obviously like makeup and that changes on a daily basis but I'd love to know what your routine is and I will see you in my next video if you've got any more types of these video requests that you want to know leave those in the comments down below as well because that would be really interesting and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!